bits. I have another third love. Oh. Third love is a bra store and underwear. And I had such a hard time fitting with fit that I've had to order online or out of the catalog for years and years. I was very happy to find, find this company. Okay, they come all bundled up. I have two bras from them already. I'll link that video below here if you want to watch that review. But I was needing a strapless bra for tops like this. This is supposed to be an off the shoulder, but I don't have a strapless bra. <sighs> so I was, I knew I was going to order one. I just was waiting. Then they had a special buy any bra and get a certain one for free. And they were both bras I was going to buy anyway, so I ordered and I got one for free. So this is the, let's see, what is this one called? 24-7 Classic Strapless Bra. This one was $68, so they, they are pricey ones. And then the straps are removable. It comes with the same color bra you choose, and then it also has clear straps. And like I said, they are removable, so you can wear it as strapless. Um, oh my gosh, look at the hooks on this one. It's got five hooks. It has some kind of rubber around the top. It's supposed to really hold you in there. I'm going to wear this for a couple weeks, and then I will... Do more of my review because I I just feel it, it really should be actually more before I can review it and that one comes in cup sizes double A through I so then the free bra was a wireless lounge bra And this is normally $48, which I just was never going to pay $48 for this sucker. So I'm glad they gave it to me for free. But the reason I wanted to try this one is it has removable pads. When you go on to Third Love, they, want, they fit you. So they ask you a whole bunch of questions. They show you pictures and say, what do your boobs look like? You know, do they... Nipples go east, west, do they point upward? Do you have relaxed breasts where they point down? They have all these pictures. And one of the options is um, asymmetric, which, I mean, most of us do have, you know, one breast is a little bit bigger. Mine, mine is more than a cup size difference. So I took the padding out of the right side and now there's two in the left. But then there's nothing on this one. Hmm. Well, that's not going to work either, is it? And they do have a plunge bra. That's the next one I want to try. That also has the removable cups. But I'm hoping on that one, the other side is padded as well. So that's a special feature on this. Um, so you can either double the pad on one side for asymmetric or just remove the pads altogether if you don't want them. This one just has two hooks and this comes in sizes extra small through extra large. All right, well, I'm going to Wear these a couple weeks and then I will come back and let you know 
what I think of them. Okay, here's the strapless bra. Fits very nicely. It's very comfortable. It has very, very good coverage. There's no lines. I mean, you can't see the bra line. So I really like this one. I have so many um, really pretty spaghetti strap and strapless tops I can I can wear now. So I really like the fit of this one. This is a lounge bra. I I hate it. There's not much for support at all. The pads, I don't know if it's coming off on camera, but it makes a really deformed shape. I'd rather just go braless, to be honest, than wear this thing. So it doesn't really, it doesn't even anything out at all. Those pads are just too small. Yeah, not a fan of this one. Glad it was free. I'd be sending it back. All right, well, I have a bra I love and a bra I hate. Let's start with the I love. This strapless bra is amazing. It has the little rubbery detail all around everything. The top and bottom stays put. It's comfy. I think I had it. I didn't even think about my bra which is you're not supposed to think about it and mess with it it was a good four or five hours before it did dig in a little bit on the sides and I just had to like slide it up a little bit or pull pull these um, whatever they're called supports it flipped under and all I had to do was straighten it out and I was good for good for another four hours. So I'm very happy with this bra. Totally covers the breast. So there's no bra line showing through on your shirt. Very happy. Very, very happy with that one. Now, this lounge bra is garbage. If you have large, relaxed breasts, just go braless. This that's not going to do much. If you have smaller, not as droopy, we'll say not as relaxed breasts, I'm sure this is very comfortable. But it really, it did nothing for me. Um, these, I was hoping to even out the unevenness. Look how thin these pads are. They're just, that's not going to do anything, even doubled. I mean, I have, the asymmetric thing is a real issue here. It's not that little bit. So I still want to try the other bra they have with removable pads. Maybe if I add these to the ones in the other one, <laughs> maybe that'll be the, the fix I need. So the other one is the plunge. I will be trying the plunge bra next. And I believe they just add, they added one in cotton, I believe. So that will be nice. So this, that was my re review of the Third Love bras. I will put my link below for my previous review. Um, I don't, that first one I was, it was a little bit awkward talking bra sizes, or talking about bras, and I was really self-conscious about my size. I didn't want to say what my size was, but I'll tell you now, because if you're checking out this video, you probably are curious about ordering the bras and if you're a similar size to me that would be helpful to know which which bras I liked that you may like as well so I did order um, the strapless one is size 38 F and it fits perfectly I actually have two sizes that I can wear the 38 F is the snugger um, around the rib cage, which is what I wanted for a strapless bra. And I, I wear it on the last 
the loosest hook. Oh, I, the first time I put this on, there's five little, there's five hooks. I mean, that took forever. I actually had to have my love come and hook my bra for me. I couldn't even do it myself. But I have been practicing and now I can hook my own bra. I'm so proud of myself. But yeah, it is with the five hooks. That, this one's a little bugger. Um, this bra is just, it's an extra large, that which was based on this size, what I should wear. And then in my first third love video I did, I also ordered a sister size, which the sister size for an, a 38F is a 40 double D. And that one I wear on the tightest hook. And it's just, it's a tiny bit too loose. I mean, it's still, it's still comfortable. I wear it all the time, but I should be in the 38F. It's just, that one seems a little too tight, but that's what this one is. So thank you so much for watching. I'd be honored if you'd like to join my YouTube family by subscribing. If you subscribe, please hit the bell so you're notified whenever I post a new video. We'll see you next time. Bye.